Right, so here we are in the Ed Shed trimming department, basically. And what I am doing is taking the diagram old one broken out, replacing it with new one, but also trying to do something with this. Taking all the dry foam off and I'm going to be replacing it and um, hopefully making it more comfy. So here we go, I've dug out as much as I can, cleaned it all up, obviously just taken all the um, old crusty um, foam off basically, the stuff that's been on there for a very long time and dried up. I've then got a big wedge of foam, kind of cut it down to fit into the, my shape here and um, pretty much got it perfect. So that goes in there like that. And then my next little bit will be getting this in and then tidying it up a bit and uh, we should be ready for putting it in the car. Right, okay. Anyway guys, so uh, we've just done this. Now this obviously is the diaphragms and you're supposed to take it all apart to do this but we didn't and all the foam and the original foam is really breaking up badly so we did it but i'd just like to say it was a fight and i really hurt my hand trying to pull these in we did the two side ones without too much of a fight but getting these man oh man you had to stretch that rubber some so uh, that's the first one done anyway so that's the, the driver's side which is the only one we're worried about at the minute because we're only going to do the driver's side because we're just I haven't got any friends. I'm going to go down on my own in it. So, yeah. <laughs> Alright, okay, yeah, we've no seatbelts, so we've got to get seatbelts in it. But anyway, so that's that. Right, so that's basically the seat. Now, I'm sure the eagle eyed people amongst you are probably going to say something like, that is not the right seatbelt. Yeah, we have actually. Oh dear, shoddy. Eh? I love you, but we've got a problem with this seat. Don't we know? Uh. We've lost, we've lost the front. Look, we've come up really in the middle, but we've lost the front. Are you out? Look. Are you out I know, but what's happened is, look what's happened. It's gone. We're gonna have to, we're gonna have to, we have to have opener. We're gonna have to go in there and try to get something in there. We're gonna have to put a piece of foam and bolster across. If you could just unhook. We'll have to and then restaple it right here. Yeah. We'll take the cover off and put take the staples off. We'll have to do it. Uh, yeah, I found yeah. a staple gun that works. Yeah, well this should be well, we've got the electric one as well there. Yeah, anyway, so our foam has collapsed, so we've got to try and get that back up. Which is not very nice. But anyway, we listen, we can't we can't we can't complain. We'd like to, but we can't, it's not a lot of point. So uh, for the minute guys, I'm gonna say to be continued. Uh, you saw that real time, real time disaster on, on time, real time disaster to notice that we've lost the front edge of our, of our seat. Obviously this is good because it'll go down, um, and it's good enough for the minute until we can either find a second hand cover or find a better cover in one of the other, because I think there's some in the other sheds, so I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, well, anyway, we're not going to worry about it. But yeah, so that's, uh, obviously, yeah. That's going to be quite nasty because there's the frame tube. So yeah. Anyway, that's just a quick uh, sort of down day on disaster time. Talk to you soon. Like and subscribe, and uh, hopefully you'll see some more. It'll be done.